Hey, how's it going everybody? In this After Effects tutorial, I have this animated logo here and I want to export this out without the white background or with no background so that I can place this logo animation on top of any footage and this would work like this. So let's get started by making sure we don't have a background. Uh, I have a solid background here. I could either delete it or disable its visibility here and make sure you toggle on the transparency grid Which you can find right here and once you do that you can see this checkered uh, Sort of grid here which ensures you have no background behind Whatever you have animated. So next let's go to composition and add this to media encoder and I'm gonna show you how to do this natively inside of After Effects as well. So stay here for that. But first, let's check out how to do this in Media Encoder. Now, once it shows up in your render queue, change from Edge 264 to QuickTime and change the preset to Apple ProRes 4444, but with Alpha. This ensures that there is no background. So make sure you always go for Alpha. And then change your file name and just export. Now, once it's done, you can drag and place this MOV file, which will be the extension of what you just exported. You can just drag it and paste it on top of any footage. And you can see that we've got what we're looking for. Now, let's try and do this uh, inside of After Effects natively. So to do that, let's go to Composition and add to Render Queue. Make sure you select output module here and change from H.264 to QuickTime or you can have uh, PNG sequence exported. But now let's stick to QuickTime and I'll explain how PNG sequence works later. Uh, make sure you select the channel as RGB plus alpha, hit OK and render. This will also give you the same result as we did uh, previously using media encoder um, and it will everything will work fine but a last option that you can also try is with PNG sequence um, do the same thing add to render queue and this time make sure you select PNG sequence and this will actually give you a sequence of images here um, with the transparent background of course and this you can import by selecting that first image and clicking on PNG sequence here and Importing it this will import all of the images that is from frame 0 to 143 here We have about 143 images in a sequence and Those are three ways how you can export your animation without a background um if this helped, please do leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next one. Cheers.